All right, let's continue this time trial. Well, not much of a time trial. This is more like an endurance round. You guys get what I mean. Okay, and I have apparently, I apparently have a shotgun. So, I uh, just need to relearn everything. Because I had a phone call to break up the session a bit. Small phone call, but it, you know, it's still interaction through a phone instead of a gamepad. Where is that one guy? I just see his name. Maybe I ran the other way. Did I? No, no, that's exactly where I should go. Do I have to kick? What? The hell? You guys heard that, right? What the hell? Oh, I see you. That's kind of disgusting. Screw you. No, no, no. You, you stay targeted. How the hell do I get you? I can't even get you. But you can't get me. Oh, I see. What is this barricade shit? I saw a barricade somewhere. Oh. Lame. <laughs> Lame. Ah, uh, screw it. He can't get... Okay, apparently he can get me. <laughs> you know what? He's no longer a problem. <laughs> I got drinks. Ah, uh, wasted some bullets on these useless peons. Hey, wait. I got more drinks. What the? I took your shotgun. Oh, you annoying bastard. No more shotgun. Boot to the head. I will take care of the cheap bastard first. You all wait your turn. I will just punch my way through life. And then you all get shotgun. What the? More? I got no problem with more. I mean, you all get a bit, bit of the shotgun. You all get a bit of the shotgun action here. Who is left standing? <laughs> There's more? No problem. I think I got one or two more bullets for you guys. Remember. Just, just get up. You. You two, face each other. He was from the first elevator, you're from the second one. And both of you failed. See? Aren't I a nice person? Uh, what do we have here? Baseball bat and a knife. I think the baseball bat's gonna do just perfectly. Oh, so this takes me directly to the roof. I got no objection with that. Hmm. What the hell? Oh, we got one of those guys. Alright. Uh, no. This is not what I need. Take this. I'm gonna beat your fucking head. Oh, and take this too. Why can't I take his gun? Oh shit. Oh, 
Oh, couldn't get him. Good enough. I was trying to get him the bonk head, but... It's all good. Steel pipe. Oh shit, this place looks like another... ton of effed up shit going on. Huh, maze. Interesting how a maze can lead me to more... bad guys. What the? Whoa! Okay, yeah, you... No more gun. Punch to the face. And I think I'll bore that. Seeing that you won't be needing it. What you'll be needing... Is money for that hospital bill. Huh. I thought this was gonna lead me straight to the roof, but apparently... I just love being bullshitted. And this, I think this bring me, brings me back to the main hallway. That's perfect. I wanna see if I can get everything covered. Why? Because I want to defeat everyone here. Extra XP, right? This guy hasn't... S has only heard of my actions and started trembling. This just shows how much of a Japanese Chuck Norris I turned out to be. Thanks for the gun. Next time, train. Okay, wait. I can't break this, but... Hmm. Alright then. Break it. Break it. Break it. I did pass by this area. Okay, that's good. At least this is some mileage covered. You know what I mean, right? At least these areas are covered. Or cleared. Now... The only thing that's left is finding the true pat, which sometimes is the less obvious one. Elevator, elevator, elevator. Well, for a bit there, I thought if I cleared everyone out, you know, some pissed off guy would have just showed up and say, yo, stop beating my friends. And he would have showed me the exit, but no, that's... That's not the way things work now. And this seems to be the most obvious pad, but... Alright, um... Let's see... Upper... Nope, wrong pad. Actually... All of the above is the wrong pad. If you look clearly at this, unless there's some kind of a barricade, I, I thought I could access this area, but you clearly can't. Now, this is the middle area, blocked as well by the middle area. So if I go on here, or over here, kind of makes me... Uh, angry at the ca the um, the map system it's a static map instead of uh, a map I'm used to where it just shifts with your position but what see the other door I couldn't go in but I apparently can go into this door Oh, I'll take you on without the gun. I was just softening you up here. Giving you a chance. You sorely need it! Thank you for the baseball bat. I will make great use of it to breaking your friend's kneecaps as well as their face 
Oh wow, this guy still had some life left. Okay. What does that give me? An alternate exit. I see it now. There's just one thing I have to see. Um, it's the abilities I already have. Okay, this I need to do more often. Head bashing. Really? I need to do this more often. Um, just to get the, the pursuit essence of smoking. That's funny as hell. Leg grabbing, that I remember. Down the enemy, of course. Um, that one was funny as hell. Komaki reversal. I just want to make sure that I have... I'm training whichever needs to be trained so I can get um, an extension to it. Head press is funny as hell as well. Ah, yes, I shouldn't forget about this one. Running at four enemies and just being badass Kiryu. And, oh, I was about to swing that bat at you, but, you know, you just... Where do you think you're going? I really don't need the gun for you. Double stomp. Stay down. Getting that gun. Who knows who's ahead? Wait, actually. This path's not open. Why is it marked as open? Maps. They screw you over. Actually. Okay. One here, two in front. Screw it. You're both going down. Or all three of you are going down. Who the hell's that last guy? Oh, it's a guy with a gun. Okay, wait. You wait right there. This guy. Oh, I can't run! Hammer time! Okay, I obviously can't move with this. Actually, can I run with it? No, I can't. Um, steel pipes. <sighs> There's one guy that's over there. I'll give him a surprise. As for you... Oh, wow. That didn't work. Cheap combo him to death. I'm surprised that machine gun guy went down that fast. I want to get mastery of this, so I'll constantly stole people in the face. Oh, what the hell? Whoa. Hey. I don't know if I ask you for anything, but a sword. I need that. Kinda having a slicing time. Where's the hammer guy? He's just staying back. Oh crap. You again. Fuck you. Okay, you can still get me in that. Oh, you annoying. Actually, this seems to be the time to use this stamina. Oh, I had my drop kick, that's true. I was trying to do the other technique, but. Hey guys, uh, small editing mistake. Well, not a mistake, it's just that I noticed uh, the sound just 
flaked out. Yes, the entire sound just flaked out as of right now. You'll notice that the video just had some kind of a weird slowdown. Matrix shit going on, but... Um, I have absolutely no idea what happened there. Which is why I'm picking this up before uploading it and everyone <laughs> getting comments or placing comments about this. Um, hey, there's one more video after this. Hopefully it won't have the same mistake. I'm sure it won't. But um, yeah, I have no idea why the audio just started flaking out. I think the entire... Um, I have no idea. I just can't seem to figure it out. I don't think if it's if it was a window update or uh, uh, some kind of a RAM issue, but since the audio is completely desynced, um, then I gotta redo the voice tracks and you know not not keep you guys bored by this entire area having desync sound not making much sense. And besides, I couldn't even add my own background music. Um, I'm kind of surprised this actually happened. I mean, I was getting ready to record more, but then I find out that this 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 sound just crapped up. Anyway, I might as well update you with more things because I tell you already, uh, the only thing that's coming up is fight, 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 and more fights. This is the Tower of Death 2 title of the movie yes um, so yeah right now finishing a few things from Com Comic Con Mini still doing it you know even at the time you're watching this pretty sure of it um, trying to get this all done before Christmas and see I was wondering if I should go into that door and then I went in there and I'm like ah I might have missed some extra XP um, but yeah, still working on uh, some sketches for people in Christmas. And I might as well just put a link to my blog on on YouTube. Because, well, enough with the, the mystery of the blog. Uh, I'm pretty sure some people were able to search for it. Uh, but yeah, posting those up on uh, Blogspot and whenever I have the time. Might even do a Tumblr, but who knows? It, it all depends on time. And time doesn't seem to be something I do have nowadays. Uh, getting sketches done and then trying to get the third volume of the comic done. To finally, you know, just to get done with that project and um, finish telling a story without expanding it too too much. But there are chapters that are that have to be done, so, you know... Uh, you gotta do what you gotta do. You don't want to be a quitter and have, have people, you know, know you as a quitter. You want to get that project, even though you want to go into another project. You want to finish that project and love it, love finishing it, you know, um, and then move on to the next project. And then it's the whole cycle starts over and over again. A bit like uh, going on with the Yakuza project. I mean, um, and I'm talking about. Uh, the game designer, how he started Yakuza 1, then went into Yakuza 2, had this whole um, image and idea in his uh, head that he wanted to let out, and then boom, you know, he, he's doing it, even jumping on other projects like Binary Domain, and still going back to Yakuza, because he has more stuff to do. And soon it's gonna be it's gonna be finished. And this is one freaky room. It's it's a lights out room practically. Uh, my only tip for you in this area is stay where the light is because you will not see whoever's attacking you from the darkness. Um, you'll basically actually a move I would recommend you to do is the running dash into heat attack or you know when you're running at four opponents while well, your heat is in red yeah pull that move off just to locate where all your opponents are using Kiryu senses <laughs> but um, yeah this this move is gonna you know tell you where all the opponents are put them on the ground and then give you a slight advantage when it comes to damage and health um, 
so yeah that's that's all I can really say about the lights out room it's a very interesting um, you know concept it, this really makes it feel like the Tower of Death where every stairs has something different um, what else what else so yeah uh, you want to finish a project you don't want to jump between projects too often uh, I mean okay now he's working on binary domain after maybe yeah after four Yakuza games and then I don't know if he worked on Dead Soul. I, I, maybe I should check out if the guy has a Twitter or something. But uh, I don't know if he was personally involved in Dead Soul. That would make five, even six if you consider Kenzen. But then he finally goes into, or you know, he just jumped into binary domain, works with a different script, and comes back to Yakuza Five, all refreshed. So. Um, it's a lot it's a series but it's a set of multiple projects and I don't know you just go to you go in your project to the end or of the end <laughs> nah truly to the end and then get it get it done get it out see what you can improve upon it and then just get to the next project so I, I wouldn't try to run that way too. Hey, if anybody is interested in that kind of, um, let's say, that kind of talk, go check Hideo Kojima's talk about Metal Gear Rising, the ups and downs the project had, and then the rebirth with Platinum Games. Uh, that was an interesting seven-part interview, and then there's a 20-part 20, 20 direct interview, all subtitled. So, yes... I'll bring you back the next part, or I'll bring out the next part, hopefully no sound fuck-ups. If there is, then I guess I gotta do a retake. Or not, that could be dangerous. Alright, see you soon.